Hello, my name is Mrs. Carlock, and I am the librarian at Dumbarton Elementary, and I am here today to talk to you about one of my favorite books, Anne of Green Gables. Anne of Green Gables is written by L. M. Montgomery, L. period M. period Montgomery, and it is a classic book, which means that it was written a long time ago, but a classic book is a type of book that you can read at any point on a timeline and it will still be relevant. This book is my original copy and I can remember vividly sitting on the beach in the summer between fourth and fifth grade reading this book and that's what I did that summer is read this book. What's fabulous about Anne is that if you fall in love with Anne just like I have then there's a whole series about Anne starting when she was a little girl all the way up to when she is a grown-up. Now Anne is an orphan and an orphan is somebody who has lost their parents. So Anne is living in an orphanage and a letter comes requesting an orphan to come and work on a farm, live on a farm with a brother and a sister to help kind of alleviate some of the work for the brother. They were expecting a boy and they got Anne. They were a little disappointed but they realized in the end what a wonderful treasure she was and how what a difference she made in their lives and all of the people on the island as well. I know that a classic book written in the late 1800s, it's a great way to think about long ago. However, what's really cool about this is recently Netflix has done a video series about Anne. It's called Anne with an E. So after you finish reading the book, if you'd like to watch Anne with an E, and then you can compare and contrast the story between the two, um, it's actually a fun way to be able to read the book. You can access Anne of Green Gables on Tumble Books, or um, the Henrico County Public Library does have an e book of it, or it could be that maybe somebody around your house is like me and they like to hoard old books and they may have a copy of it hanging around somewhere too. So I hope you enjoy it and I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you for watching.